Hi guys, I hope you're all well. It's currently Sunday the 2nd of April 2023 and welcome to week 377 of my weight loss journey. In last week's video we all saw I had a loss of one pound or 0.4 kilogram which saw my body mass index go from 52 down to 51.8. I'm going to start the proceedings off by reviewing my calorie consumption for the past week which we can see in the graph above. The average this was 2,416 compared to the previous week at 2,370. It has increased. It's within overall my average allowance for the week which is 2500 as an average um tuesday as i mentioned last week i did have to do a business trip just north of london uh, and this is the day where i did end up having a sandwich and some crisps um so yeah i don't usually like having bread during the week because i know it can throw me out in terms of my weighing result um but um yeah there wasn't really many options available so the sandwich was the best of the options and um, so I'm hoping that doesn't mess me up too much on my weighing result. My fluid consumption has increased slightly to 3,264 millilitres which is still falling short of my 3,500 millilitre target as an average for the week. Let's move on to my activity levels. Uh, we all know I like to monitor my step count. This can be seen in the graph above. The average of this was 5,600 compared to the previous week at 6,064. It has reduced. Not surprised by this one at all. Um, like when you're driving, there's not much walking taking place other than <coughs> when you pull into a service station. Um, so. I'm not surprised by seeing a reduced amount of steps, um, especially on the Tuesday. And uh, the weather as well, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, hasn't been the best. I'd say it's been raining out, up, throughout all the lunch time, so it's been a bit tricky um, fitting in some walking, especially during my lunch hour. It's that time of the week where we all get to see my latest weighing results, so here it is guys, here's my weighing. <laughs> I weigh 177.6 kilograms, which is 391.5 pounds, or 27 stone 13.5 pounds. This means in the past week, unfortunately, I've seen a gain of half a pound, or 0.2 kilogram. Now, if I compare this result to the result I obtained at Slimming World, you can see this right here. At Slimming World this week, I also saw a gain of half a pound, or 0.2 kilogram. Based on this week's weight gain, it sees my body mass index go from 51.8 up to 51.9. And look at my third weight loss target. Last week it was 14.6% complete. And after the gain, it goes down to 13.9% complete. So in the 377 weeks that I've been doing this weight loss journey, I have lost a total of 149.7 pounds, which is 67.9 kilograms, or 10 stone, 9.7 pounds. Next week, obviously, I'm hoping to turn around this half a pound gain that I saw and see, hopefully, a one and a half pound loss minimum. Uh, we'll just have to wait and see what happens. I do have another business trip to do on Tuesday, yet again, but this time, not as far south, but just, just north of Birmingham. So, um, we'll see what happens. Uh, try to make some good choices on that day uh, it's likely that it's going to be another sandwich that will probably be the best option available to me um yeah i want to see a loss result i want to continue seeing loss results all ideally for the rest of my weight loss journey but we all know we don't live in such an idyllic world um we're bound to see ups and downs along a weight loss journey uh, and I'm no exception. Um, but anyway, uh, ideally, a loss result next week. Uh, we just have to wait and see what happens. But other than that, guys, that's it. That's the end of this week's video. As always, if you'd like to continue following me along my weight loss journey and hopefully get to see much less of me in the future, by all means, subscribe to my channel so you don't get to miss out on any future videos that I post. I wish you all a fantastic week. Stay safe, look after another, and I'll see you all again next Sunday.